Hi, this is Lilia from Heal Scotland. Who is the community for? Who is it for and why would you come there? Well, if you have any chronic health issue, like diabetes, um, MS, Parkinson's, fibromyalgia, lupus, um, on and on, I've probably forgotten a few of the more common ones there, arthritis, huge problem in our area, um, or cancer in any stage, whether you have had treatment, maybe you're still suffering from fear, or maybe if your cancer's come back and you want to try other things, maybe if you're overweight and you've really it's really getting you down, um, or if you're anxious and depressed and you really you need company and you need support in your journey, there's a kind of gap in our um, healthcare system where you know you're either in hospital or you're at home on your own, and there's even a phrase called bed blockers. For people who are taking up beds, which I think is horrendous phrase, <laughs> it's really sad that that's what we've got to. But um, really, if you need support, unfortunately, we can't do any full-blown nursing support at this stage. Um, that's something we plan to offer in the future. So you really need to be able to look after yourself to a degree, although we can assist. But if you really need help and there is nowhere for you to go, and you can't afford to go to the Oasis of Hope in Mexico or the Gerson Centre um, in Mexico, and perhaps you're not allowed to fly because of insurance, that's another reason. We're creating this amazing place in mid because for people to come and to help them and to teach them all the things that they can do to help themselves. A lot of people now are, are feeling that they, they don't want to take a lot of drugs for the rest of their life and that they don't really know how to get off them, they don't really know what to do instead because... Often, if you're going to take come off like high blood pressure drugs, for example, you need to make sure that you can control your blood pressure, because if you can't, you need to take the drugs. So it's a bit of education around hydration and how to keep the body in homeostasis and balance and all the different things you can do. So don't go just coming off all your drugs. Learn first and work with us or with your GP to wean yourself off drugs that maybe are dulling your energy and your life force. So. But if you want to talk about anything, if there's maybe you're in a lot of pain, that's another thing. I mean, I had postmenopausal arthritis and I was in my shoulder, my lower back, all my all my hinges <laughs> were like really starting to give me a bit of jip. So but I've healed that now um, because I knew that I could. I don't get me wrong. I suffered it for a little while before I got my ass in gear to change the things that I knew I had to change in order to get well again and to get healthy and fit because I've always been fit but I really had a few years there where I was just a lazy cow and um, it didn't sit with me well with me. I much prefer having high energy and I certainly much prefer having a body that's free from pain. I still appreciate it every single day. So if chronic pain's an issue, if digestive problems, we've got a few amazing girls who have healed themselves from Crohn's and colitis and that's another really common problem. Anything that's happening down your digestive system that's not right nip it in the bud. Prevention. We need to talk about prevention. Honestly, we have a shocking health picture in Scotland and, um, and in England too. I'm not, but this particular project is really aimed at Scottish people um, because there's 5.2 million of us and I really believe if we can all pull together and get motivated and inspired, we can change this round without having to give up all the things that we love. <laughs> That's my belief and I'm sticking to it. So if you're interested in coming out in our community or if you know somebody who could benefit, everybody knows somebody who should come. <laughs> Maybe it's you. I know it takes guts to put your hand up and say, look, I need help. But this is a real cutting edge project happening in mid -Argyle. There's an opportunity here for you to really transform how you feel and your health and happiness. And you will just be so glad that you did. So if you're interested, pluck up the courage, make the call. I'm happy to talk to you. We want to measure these things that we're going to do in this community. And then we want to lobby for change. We want the fear out of health care. Stop terrifying people about their bodies and using words and numbers that may contribute to people's, certainly to their suffering and perhaps to their demise. That has to stop. So that's me on my mission and I hope to chat to you and see you soon. Please share the video if you feel it's something that you resonate with. Cheers.